Hello, grade 11. And uh, I know that yesterday you probably didn't have enough time to do all the databases because you have to do the friends DB, the contacts DB, and the shops DB. So today you will have time to catch up. But what I'm going to do very quickly is just to do the shops DB on 8.1.2 on page 171. So we're going to open access just to refresh your memory find start and then find access right at the top oh, the letter A is easy to find and then click blank database and then click the little browse for a location and then go find your location obviously you're going to use your H drives or your flash drive if you want and then we're going to call it shops db i'm doing the second one here i'm going to choose the type very important don't forget that very important shops db shops db and then i click ok and then i click create and we're done now we have to go and create some fields so go to view and design view we'll keep our primary key field view design view we're going to call it TBL Shops. TBL Shops. Oops. Okay. Now, over here, we're going to add some fields. Name. I'm not going to use the word name, remember. We don't use the word name, so I'll just say shop name. And that can be text. And I'll change that to 40 over here. Then the next one will be physical address. I'm just going to call it address. And that will also be short text. And we could possibly use all those all those characters for an address, you know. Uh, or maybe make it 160. Then we'll have web address. Web address and we can choose 30 character maybe 40 for that and then the type now you mustn't use the word type okay that's the shop type what kind of shop is it don't use the word type access will have a problem with that word just believe me and over here i could have let's say 50 characters so these are all strings so far. Number of times you've used them. Um, mm, quantity visits. Let's call it visits. And that'll be the number of visits. So it's an integer number. And I'll keep it as long integer. As you visit a website. Um, I'm assuming that it's about shops, you know, online. The last time you used that shop a date last visited must be a descriptive and we'll choose date time and remember about this short date and short date as the input mask and just click next next and finished and now we have that now what we should really be doing, and this will be the primary key, we can write out that primary key description and the name of the shop. You just write of the shop. You type in there address, physical address. You have to type in um, internet address slash URL shop type of what does the shop sell something to that effect number of visits to the shop and last visited date of the last visit so that's it now we've created the database end of story okay so rest of this lesson catch up create all your databases and make sure you've got the friend db database as well so this is a catch-up lesson and we'll see you tomorrow